So, as we know, we, wait, we have a shout out song, right? Shout out. Creepy. Shout out, shout out, shout We're just out. back to the Alex Jones. It's cool. It's good. I'm looking for a remix. And now the shout out. 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 of ideas was turned to low. It's quickly moving into the hot position. And now the shout out. Shout out. That's a video. Shout out. Recovery mode. That's somebody else. Shout out. Shout out. Geopolitical politics. Shout out. Shout out. Shout out. Shout out. Shout out. Shout out. He's saying it to a Glenn Beck tonight. He's saying it's a Glenn. Well, maybe we'll snag some yeah, Glenn Beck. I'll try to fire through some. Maybe we'll get some Glenn Beck action. Glenn Beck, Dave Rubin mockery going. One of the missions of this show and one of the ways that we've been participating in international solidarity is to free political prisoner Lula da Silva, who, as you know, uh, was put in jail on politically tumped up charges by the corrupt Lava Jato investigation backed by the Department of Justice in the United States, which is culminated in the election of the fascist Jair Bolsonaro and the burning of the Amazon. Uh, and also that Lula lifted 40 million people out of poverty when he was president of Brazil. This incredibly brilliant young chap, uh, scroll it up, Matt, Alan Lee Rogers was at a Bernie event. That's at A-L-L-E-A-N 51. Was at a Bernie event. Uh, that's at A-E-N. Oh, uh, excuse me. Is this him that he posted it? Is this yeah, him? This who, is him. Okay, cool. Awesome. Was at a Bernie event in South Carolina, and he asked the following question and got this following very good response from Senator Sanders. Listen back there. Let's take those three questions. Okay. Uh, Senator Sanders, in the past couple of years, we have seen the rise of these far-right authoritarian leaders and the effect they have had on the stability of our world such as in Brazil, where a corrupt investigation has falsely imprisoned their popular and former president, Lula da Silva. How will the Sanders administration address these leaders and their negative impact on our world? Lula Livre. Well, as somebody who has written to Brazilian authorities to get Lula out of jail, it's an issue that I feel very strongly about. And that is the United States needs to conduct a foreign policy based on democracy and human rights the very opposite of what Trump is doing now as he supports authoritarian governments in Brazil and all over the country. So I can't emphasize how important, I mean, look, obviously Lula matters and Brazil matters profoundly in and of itself, but we're gonna go in the post game and show you what Bernie said about Kashmir and the fact that Bernie is light years ahead of anybody else when you're talking about Israel-Palestine. He's the only person in Israel-Palestine who's put foreign aid on the table. And frankly, if you don't put that as a bare minimum on the table, you're not serious about confronting Israeli apartheid, period, full stop. Even if now occasionally other Democratic candidates might gingerly, remotely acknowledge the obvious about the nature of the Israeli government and the relationship to the Palestinians. Bernie Sanders is not perfect and nobody is perfect, but you're starting to really see an assembly here from talking about the military budget after voting against military budget increases, three military budget increases that Elizabeth Warren voted for, to being clear about the freeing of Lula, to talking about what has happened in Central America, going back to U.S. intervention in the 80s, you're seeing the outlines, as well as this incredible Green New Deal package that they've put out, which is stunning. I mean, the Green New Deal package is beyond anything that anybody's put forward in modern politics who has a shot of winning the presidency. So shout out to this incredible question and shout out to Sanders continuing with courage and clarity to lead here. It's extraordinary that somebody with this instinct and this record and this commitment is in a position to be elected president. It's, it's not to be trifled with if you have an actual commitment on this stuff. It's, it's stunning. You've just watched a Michael Brooks show video and you can watch all of our full main live shows every Tuesday night at around 7 p.m. Eastern time and subscribe to get all of the clips you want. We're covering the globe. We're focusing on international relations, the intellectual dark web. We're having fun. We're doing deep dives with a lot of amazing guests. Of course, become a patron for the whole thing at patreon.com slash TMBS or subscribe to this YouTube channel and help us keep growing and get that content out there. Subscribe below.